Greetings viewers at home, this is Prophet Gottfried Sessler, a founder of Grace Alive Church, a son to Prophet Hope Manana. Today we are speaking about a role of a woman in marriage. Look, the Bible says that a woman was created in the book of Genesis. He was created to be a helper of a man. Now you need to understand that as a woman, you are a helper of a man. You need to understand that your role is to support your husband. Your role is to make your husband to be the best thing that he can ever be. Now we find most of the time that many women are challenging their husband. But your role is to support your husband. Is to show your husband not in front of people his errors. But is to show your husband when you are, you, are, you, are, you are in a separate room to say, look my husband, this is my error. This is your error that you made today. And now we can do this to help us. The Bible says that a role of a woman, firstly, is to be a helper. Secondly, is to submit. Thirdly, is to respect a husband. Now, we need to understand that to submit, it does not mean you submit even when you feel that it is good. You submit even you feel that is in pain, but still you submit to your husband. How do you submit? You, you must be humble to your husband. You must respect your husband. You must make sure that your husband feels that he is, re he is respected by you. The Bible says that women honor your husband. So you need to honor your husband. You need to to honor your husband. It does not mean that when times are good, it does not mean when you are happy. Even when it's bad, you must honor your husband. Look, as a Christian woman, you pray for your husband. The Bible says, Hannah was a woman. And the Bible says that Hannah was, was not having children. The Bible says after he made a supper, after he prepared for his husband, he went to the temple to pray. Look, it does not mean when you are angry, your husband must feel your anger. You must go and tell God and say, Lord, this is the husband you gave me. And for that reason, I am praying for my husband. You as a woman, you got power to change the mind of your husband in prayer. Look, you, if you try to change the mind of your husband without praying, you can never change the mind of your husband. But only one person who can change it is God. So as a woman, you come to God and say, God, this is the husband you gave me. Look my, look my sister, look, you are a woman and as a woman you were taken out of the reap of your husband. Meaning as a woman you are a part of your husband. As a woman you are the one that can tell God better about your husband. To say, Lord, I was taken out of my husband. Since I was taken out of my husband, Lord, I pray for my husband. You, you must go and pray. You must go to God. Look, if you challenge your husband with ways, you will never win the battle. But the only way to win the battle is when you are praying for your husband. You need to say, Lord, this is the man you gave me. So, Lord, I respect the husband. So, now, that's why I come to you. I can never challenge my husband because he is the head and I am the leg. I support. I am the reason that my husband is there in life. Look, if you are there as a woman and you know your role is to help your husband, you need to help your husband. Look, you need to help your husband. Whether it's good, but you need to help your husband. But there's only one person who can change your husband. That is God. You need to pray. As a wife, you need to pray. A prayerless woman does not defeat. The Bible says in the book of Proverbs, a woman wakes up when it's still dawn. He prepares for her husband. He manages the house. A woman who is in marriage, manage the house. If you fail to manage the house, you can never manage the life of your husband. You need to manage your household. Prepare for your husband. In order for your husband to be active in the morning, it starts by you preparing for your husband. So in order, how do we see that a woman, that a woman is a great woman? We see, but when we see the husband being active in life, when we see the husband when he's outside the people, Taking control, we know that there is a backbone that is a woman. But if you as a woman, you are the one who's crushing your husband, it means you are failing to be a woman that respects, that honors, that helps the husband. You are not a helper, but you are a destroyer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Prophet Godfrey. 
Don't forget to subscribe in Debiton TV. Hashtag we are doing it ourselves.